What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Presidential Bites. Today, I'm gonna to be recreating a special dish that Obama had from Ben's Chili Bowl, which is the half-smoked chili dog. I know that this recipe is top secret, but is there anything that you guys can like share with us today? Well, you know it's our mm. secret recipe. <laughs> yeah. And it's loaded with love. That's the key ingredient, right? Exactly. So where did this recipe come from? Is it like a family recipe? Oh my goodness. The recipe came from my husband and me. Wow. Yes, a great recipe. My husband was the original of the recipe. So hopefully I can represent for him and Obama today. Thank you guys so much. All right, yo. So we're getting into the chili now. Something that's really interesting about this recipe is all the amazing spices, so I can only imagine how great this is gonna taste. First things first, I have my pot getting hot while I'm gonna get into the flavoring. So, we are going to add our garlic powder, onion, beef bouillon, chili powder, masa harissa, which I think thickens the sauce. We have some cayenne, some paprika, turmeric, cumin, and red curry powder. Lots of spice. So I'm just gonna whisk this up into a bowl and I'm gonna slowly pour in some water. So this is pretty much the base of the chili. It's gonna be what makes the chili super banging. And then I'm gonna move back over to the pot. We're gonna add our beef into this pot and then we're just gonna like break it up. This recipe is very interesting to me because the water goes straight in with the beef, which I heard that this is what makes the consistency of the chili like nice and loose, not too thick. So I'm just gonna break this down. I'm gonna add some water into this. And I'm gonna let this cook out. So I'm gonna grab the lid and I'm gonna put it on top and I'm gonna make sure this is really hot before I add all of my flavorings, my tomato paste, and bay leaf. Okay, so now we have the ground beef and the water at a boil. I'm just gonna give it a mix, and then at this point is when we are gonna add our chili paste slush mix. Straight in there, straight like that. Next, I'm gonna give it a mix one more time. Then I'm gonna add our tomato paste which is gonna give it that nice sweetness. And then I'm gonna add our bay leaves. And then the lid is gonna go back on and we're gonna cook this for about an hour. So we're gonna prep the links and we're also gonna prep to vote. Make sure you guys get out there and go vote. If you're not registered, do so now. And by the time you come back, the chili will be ready. So now that this chili smells amazing in here, we are going to take our hot links and we're gonna broil them. You guys can grill them or boil them, but you wanna make sure you're going for that nice smoky and snappy texture when you bite down into your chili dog. Okay guys, these dogs look amazing. They're charred and they're crispy like I like. I'm gonna go ahead and give this a taste right before we plate this up. Tastes amazing. So the way Obezi ordered this was American mustard, white onions, so I'm gonna do just that. I'm just gonna add a little bit of, actually a lot of it because I like mustard. And I'm gonna add raw onions right on top. Beautiful. I'm gonna load this up with the chili. Can I do that? I hope I can do that. I'm gonna do it. So I'm just gonna go chili right on top. And there we have it, the presidential obese dog. Smells popping, it smells amazing. We're about to get into it. Thank God I'm wearing an apron because I got a white tee on. I'm just gonna go for it. Mmm. Mmm. So I can taste all the spices coming through. The mustard on there is amazing. The white onions are giving it that nice freshness, that nice texture. The chili is really where it's at though. All the spices, the way it's cooked down, at first I said earlier, I was like, yo, this is gonna be like really weird without like browning it, but with all that water, it really made for like a nice, smooth consistency and texture. I think this is such a presidential dog. This is banging. I see why Obama ordered this. Shout out to Ben's Chili Bowl. If you guys ever make it around to DC, make sure you guys tap in with them. But one thing you guys have to do is make sure you guys tap in, get registered to vote. I'm about to do so and fulfill my civic duties as an American while eating this American chili dog. 
The recipe for this chili dog is gonna be down below in the deeps. Peace out, go vote, do the right thing, eat a chili dog.